The Nuclear Regulatory Commission's role in the nuclear industry is really a regulator's role. Our role is to help make safe use of nuclear technology possible, and we want to be ready as an agency to do that for advanced reactors. We really look at analysis as well as test data and, and operating experience for normal operating conditions and abnormal operating conditions. A lot of these concepts had been tested in the early days of nuclear in the 50s and 60s and 70s. The design, test, and evaluation of a fast reactor power plant is part of the United States Atomic Energy Commission's power reactor program. But we've come a long way since then. New materials have been developed, new modeling and simulation capabilities have developed, new computing capability developed, new manufacturing techniques. The versatile test reactor will kind of help fill a gap that's needed to help push these concepts forward. Right now, there are test reactors operating in the U.S and around the world, but what we're missing in the U.S. is the fast neutron flux. The fast neutrons that the versatile test reactor can provide. I think it does have that potential to provide reactor and fuel developers and designers with those testing capabilities to fill data gaps, reduce uncertainties, and accelerate uh, the deployment of, of their advanced reactor concept. The ability to have that capability in, in the U.S. Is, is really important. I think we don't want to depend on foreign capabilities where we don't have to. For example, for fast neutron flux test reactor, the only one that really is operating right now is in Russia. And our ability to access and then obtain quality data from that is really almost impossible or, or very, very limited at, at best. So having that domestic capability, I think is really important for U.S. to regain leadership in this area. VTR, solving energy challenges through science.